All right, people, welcome back to the league. So thanks for all the support. So before we begin, let's go over what happened last week and the current standing. So in the top division or the YCS division, in first place, tied for first place, we have the Kaba White Dragons and the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, who uh, the Kaba White Dragons beat the Kite Galaxy Photons with their Tier 1 Clear Forts versus uh, Kite Galaxy Photons uh, Tier 3 Modoches and was awarded one point. And the Yuya Pendulum Dragons defeated the Yugi Dark Magicians using their Tier 1 Pendulum Magicians versus the Yugi Dark Magicians Tier 3 Sylvan, so they were awarded one point each. And in second place or last place, we have the Yuma Utopians who lost to the Jack Red Arch Fiends. Uh, Burning Abyss versus Necros, so Tier 1 versus Tier 1. If you haven't seen that, go back and watch that in Week 1. And the Kite Galaxy Photon, so like I said, uh, lost with their Mendoches Tier 3 versus the Ki versus Kaiba White Dragons in a divisional match. So there you go. So 1 point for the Kaiba White Dragons and the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, and 0 points for the Yuma Utopians and the Kite Galaxy Photon. But they still have a plenty of time to catch up. And in the lower division, or the regional division, we have, in first place, the Yusei Star Dragons with three points. Yes, uh, the Yusei Star Dragons were awarded three points for their Tier 3 deck of Heraldic Beast, beating a divisional matchup of the Zane Cyber Dragons, who decided to use their Tier 1 deck of Heroes. In second place, we have the Jack Red Archfiends, who were awarded one point for beating the Yuma Utopians, uh, Burning Abyss versus Necros, Tier 1 versus Tier 1. And in third place, or last place, we have the Yugi Dark Magicians, who of course lost to uh, the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, uh, Tier 1 versus Tier 3, and was awarded 0 points. And as stated before, the Zane Cyber Dragons did lose to Yusei Star Dragons in a divisional matchup, so are also awarded 0 points for the previous week. So, uh, there's of course plenty of time to catch up. We have 6 more weeks until the playoffs, so, you know, plenty of time for things to get changed up, for teams to earn more points, or not getting points at all. So I hope that you guys are looking forward to week two. I know I am. So thank you guys for tuning in once again for another week of Yu-Gi-Oh! 2 Draft League. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And let's get it started. All right, people. Welcome back to the league. This is season one, week two, match one of the league. So we have uh, Pops here representing the Yugi Dark Magicians versus Slate. Uh, representing uh, Zane Cyber Dragons. I keep forgetting. <laughs> it's, gonna, it's probably gonna take me all season to remember whatever. You came is. up with half the names, and I came up with the other half. And I, I, yeah, I, I, I could probably remember like some of the names, but then it's like the, the names some of the, the ones that like, uh, you came up with. We can't remember the ones I came up. With. Uh, I, just, I just can't. I can't remember anything. <laughs> so thank you guys for all support. So welcome back, week two. So uh, if you guys remember from last week, uh, Pops actually lost. Uh, so, still uh, zero points, and Slate actually lost, so zero points as well. So both of these people are Just trying to at least get the their first points. They're trying to get their first point. Uh, this is not a divisional match, so they're in different division divisions. And uh, so far, I, I really can't. St I mean, of course, you guys know uh, which deck they are using because it's in the title. But for right now, can't go ahead and state what deck anybody's using until someone plays something. <laughs> you know, then we can actually start doing actual commentary on you know upcoming plays and such like that but uh yeah both of them are looking for their first point uh in the league of course week two we still got plenty of more time for them to go ahead and catch up uh, you know they're not too far behind yet yeah so far Omega chaos is leading with his three points oh right yeah down. i'm in the lower division definitely yeah in the upper division, everybody pretty much burned their tier one deck. Tier one, like everyone was like, tier one all the way, go! <laughs> so now we're just sitting here, so of course this week, uh, there's probably not going to be a lot of tier one usage. <laughs> no, of considering you... like half the, t half the teams just burnt through their tier one in the first week. <laughs> so, um, this duel is very slow. I would like for you guys to go ahead and do something. Oh, well, just as you say that. <laughs> yeah. No, damn it! <laughs> Still, damn nothing nothing to reveal what anybody is using yet. <laughs> book, my favorite spell card in the game. Fun fact. Okay, okay. So, here we go. Pot, this should definitely at least reveal something. There you go. Alright, so we see that Slate Warrior here is using his Tier 3 Dustin's. So, depending on what Pop's using, either if Pop's using his, his Tier 3 also as well, and Slate wins, he only gets one point. But if uh, if Pop's is using his Tier he's 2, tier two, then he gets two, two points. points. So, so, it all comes down to what Pop's is using right now. Yeah. 
But uh, thank you guys for all the support on the league. I, I really appreciate it. You know, uh, you guys are awesome, and thank you guys for tuning in. You know, uh, we we are gonna have a lot of duels, a lot of uh, fun here. So uh, be sure to tune in each week. So he's gonna go ahead and summon that uh, Stygian security. The court one is destroyed. He's gonna go ahead and summon a level one fiend type monster from his deck. And of course, it's Dustin's. He's gonna summon that house Dustin and go stupid. To so, town. Yeah, just go to town. <laughs> you know, it's interesting. It's interesting. You know, with with uh, Slate or what he did last week with the uh, you know Electrum, Lotike, and this Slate's week. Slate's just the sassy person. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, he probably is. He's like it's like all about winning. You know. Uh, he'd like, probably come out less like, with chicken race. Fuck fun. I want fuck fun. I want to wreck everyone's asses like them. So he's gonna go ahead and uh, use that uh, token to go ahead and destroy the Stygian Street. Put oh, I, I keep on wanting to say Stygian Street for choice. Stygian Security. Security. <laughs> like no, that's the other one. <laughs> yeah, that's the other one. The good one that's used in Infinity. <laughs> go ahead. R and, oh, he's gonna go ahead and summon his <laughs> king. So. Wow, he controls another uh, fiend type monster. Uh, set in battle phase, pops. Yeah, yeah, it was a pretty set in battle phase. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you know that new rule in Yu-Gi-Oh? When your opponent summons a goblin king, you can set a spell or trap in your ba in your, your opponent's yeah, battle what's, phase. What's the only way you can set okay. a card in your battle phase is what you dust turn or something in battle phase. <laughs> yep. So standby phase, he's going to go ahead and activate that Blaze Accelerator, and that has revealed so this the is deck. His two, this is his it? tier 2 deck, Volcanic. Alright, this is for 2 points for Slate. Yep, 2 points for Slate, 1 points for Pops, of course. So, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. so, so with everybody using their tier 1 decks last, so he, it's not like anybody can like go for uh, an Omega Chaos and try to earn 3 points by crushing someone's tier 1, because... I, I don't know. Everybody just decided up oh, week one, gotta use my tier one. So. Tier one, let's go, everyone. <laughs> yes. So, of course, this isn't gonna be boring with, uh, you know, everybody just using all the tier ones. He's gonna play mm, Where Fry Art Thou. Yeah. So, he's gonna yeah. add a level one monster. If he controls the level one monster, he has to add a level one monster, and then he takes 2,000 damage during the end phase. If you did not normal or normal summon the added monster. Okay. So, he's probably gonna Very hard with the same name. Oh, well, the card with the same name. I can activate this card, so I just think he's just gonna head and summon the house dust nice on and, and try to go to town and try to end this real quick with the power yeah. of uh of the dust duns. <laughs> yeah. He's gonna do some dusting. Mm-hmm. So now since we it's confirmed what they're using this week, then we can go I guess we can go ahead and discuss next week. So of course Pops next week he cannot use volcanic, so he's either gonna use his tier three yeah. which is I don't remember. <laughs> What's his, so what's, his, what's his tier 3? Oh, Sylvan. Yeah. Sylvan's. That's, no, no, no. No, Sylvan's just Kyle. That's Kyle, no. What the hell is his tier 3? Oh my Pops, god. What's your tier 3? Tell us, oh. like, just tag. Alright, so yeah, <laughs> either, so his, either his tier 3 Light Thorns or, of course, going back to his tier 1 of Necros and Slate uh, cannot use his uh, tier 3 being Dustin, so he's either going to use his tier 2 Black Wings or go back to his tier 1 being Heroes. So, uh, will we see them risk the biscuit and actually start using other tiers besides the tier one or tier two? Yeah. And, I mean, and they now the start to need risking it because they're all going to be behind and make chaos no matter what on this one. <laughs> Whoever wins. Well, uh, Pops is in the upper division, so he doesn't even, you know, it's, it's Slate that he needs to start catching I'll up. I'll take, hang on, Slate's asking if he'll take 2k, but he normal summoned it, didn't, didn't he? It, sung, it doesn't have to be on the field, just you have to normal summon it or a card with the same name. Oh, well, technically it wasn't summoned. Yeah, technically it wasn't summoned. Yeah, so you do take the 2k, yeah. yeah. so you will be taking the 2k during the end phase. Yeah. There we are. That's a nice advantage of having, like, them both on call, but on mute. Yeah. You can just talk to them. So it's like, it's like all right, so I'm going to go ahead and we take 2k. We don't have 2K. to spend five minutes being like, no, 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 do that. No, no, no. Um, oh, god damn it. <laughs> so Speaking it's good. So Pops went ahead and saw him warning that house, Dustin. So he paid 2000 so, not only does Slate not get off his plate, but then he's also going to take 2,000. <laughs> Everyone gets 2,000 to the face. It's like, 2,000, check under your seats, Oprah style. <laughs> you take 2,000, and you take 2,000. <laughs> oh my god, the craziness is real. So, he's going to go ahead and flip up that uh, that white Dustin. Uh, the proudest of them all. The KKK member, White Power. <laughs> and uh, we have Goblin King here. He's going to go ahead and make C instead. Alright, so, the Slacker Magician, and of course, another token on the field. <laughs> so, uh, let's see, he's gonna go ahead and stall out with Slacker for a little while. Yeah, and then also, yeah, you should have took the 2000 in the interface late. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
So them, them, <laughs> them, uh, black gardens. Black magician's a good card. Yeah, it really is. It really is. You know, mm-hmm. in general, you see even more sacky deck just because there's not a lot of decks that play level Wasn't one. Wasn't it known as shiny magician, or was that another card? I know there's a card called shiny magician, but was that its OC Slack magician's OCG name, or was it? Is it another card? Yeah, it's like Schneet or Schneit, Schneit Magician. S H Y N E E T. So I call it Shiny. <laughs> I call it Shit yeah. Magician. <laughs> shit Eat. Nice. Yeah, Shit Eat. <laughs> hey, you gotta remember you're, when your shit has to be neat. <laughs> Once uh, your turn can be destroyed by battle during either player's turn. When a card effect is actually captured, you can get that. No, could have negated, but... Yeah, couldn't he just attach to ha- prevent it from being destroyed by card effects? Well, a bit late now. Yeah. Because <laughs> it's optional, oh, well. right? We're not going to tell you how to play Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh, no, it says that targets... No, no, that says that, that targets the face of oh, card. Oh, right, and, okay. Yeah. I was about to say. Yep. So, no. Nope. This ain't DN Dual Commentaries. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't doing babysitting. Yeah. Unless you want to pay us. But once again, you're going to go ahead and use... You should so do that. Like Next time you do a DM Duel commentary and you have to babysit someone, you should PM them and be like, uh, can you give me some money now? And they'll be like, wait, what? Why? And you'll be like, me babysitting you. <laughs> you be super cute with it. Yep. So, I'm going to go ahead Uh-oh. and reload it up. The power. The power from... Uh, definitely worthy of a tier 2. Uh... Mm-hmm. Volcanics. Not quite tier one. At least brief spell is tier one. It's like that sort of lowest tier one. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Volcanics, but you now it's like it's like in the same boat as like heroes and yang and yang zing. It's Not like that sort of. You send you the no. other wide deck. Yeah. It's like it's... <laughs> yes, the other wide deck. It's like one point five. Yeah. Sort of. Damn you! You you put them that high. I'd say that the, 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 that sort of spot where it's not quite tier one, but I wouldn't say they're quite tier two personally. All right, so summoning of a uh, ooh, oh, damn. target and then just desserts. Ouch! <laughs> wow, really? GG. GG. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> It was it was stuff with slate and being 25. dirty. It's, it, yeah, what, it's twenty five. Yeah, twenty five for each. Wow, what it was slate? Yeah, Hello, what is stuff with you and being dirty? <laughs> you're gonna be like you're gonna be like the the evil person in the league, the dirty one, the one that everybody loves to hate. <laughs> yep. So damn. And just when you he's, thought he's, that pop was gonna no, pull something, slate up. is the humor. Slate is the fucking humor of the league. No one likes him. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, but you know what's you know what's funny. Evil. You know what's funny? What? Slate is the captain of the Zane Cyber Dragons, which is, of course, Infinity, which everybody hates. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Everybody okay. loves to hate, so we're going to go ahead and pause the other side and uh, go on to game two. All right, people, we are back. So uh, this is a game two. So Slate's right. in the first game with yep. us. Uh, just, mm. <laughs> just burned him. <laughs> Just the dirtiness, just, all just of the it. the dirtiness. <laughs> just, yeah. you, you love to hate him. Is that how, how it is? <laughs> hey, it doesn't matter as long as he wins the championship. <laughs> yeah. You always need... Someone's got to be the bad guy, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, Pops is going first. And the thing is, if he wins this, then he does get two points. Yeah, his, his, his tier three would beat the tier two of Pops, so that is two points. Wow, he's gonna yeah. go ahead and use the mulligan roll. Starting off, uh, it's fine. You gotta reveal your hand. Yeah, you gotta reveal your hand, guys. Yeah, yeah. All right, reload, and then the rest of it. Really? That was a bad hand. Okay. I mean, the summer monk because there's no spells besides that. It seems like uh, yeah, it seems like a decent hand to me. That, it seemed it seemed pretty fun. You got your bottomless. You got your scale. You got your reload. I don't know. <laughs> I said, we're, we're not the ones judging you. <laughs> the viewers are judging you. I, I guess they get to go ahead and determine what's good and what's not. And the judge, jury, and executioner. <laughs> All right. Uh, like duality, maybe a little bit of a, a planter. Not, there's not too many spells that volcanics play. So no. he went ahead and used his mulligan, the one per match. <laughs> so you know, yep. hopefully it was worth it. <laughs> hopefully he got mm-hmm. at least a better hand, because that hand didn't seem too bad to me. That that seemed okay to me. You had your shell, you had your reload, you had your bottomless. I mean, you had your I mean what's the really what's the bottomless gonna do? Well, <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah. But I guess he just wanted but to go yeah. ahead and do the mulligan, so he didn't want to take the risk of, you know, the hand's not bad, but I guess he didn't want to take the risk of losing. <laughs> you know what would be fucked up is if he mulliganed into a worse hand. <laughs> hey, I mean, that's the thing. It one. could happen. It could happen. It could happen. It's still a risk. You can mulligan into something worse. It's always a factor. That is the that and there we go. We see the one tech card that apparently Slate runs in every deck, uh, uh, Piper, because <laughs> even in his Black Wings, <laughs> Piper's Piper is pretty good. But Piper to get the best use out of it, you gotta have them King Bios. <laughs> Just King Bios, summon it, Piper tribute itself, King Kira turn back to hand. So good. It's like an instant draw engine for you. you almost summon every fucking turn. It's great. Oh, and of course he's gonna grab it. Shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised he didn't grab the ceasefire. Just the burn for some more. <laughs> yeah. The burning is too real. I said, it's good. Like I said, I mean, this matchup isn't favorable to Pops because, like I said, he pays. It's okay, but tribute is the cost. Isn't it? Tribute's the cost, and then it resolves in the grave, doesn't it? I believe so. Yeah. Oh. And he gets something because that's a normal. That was a level one, wasn't it? Don't it? Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, tribute. Right, I guess. Yeah. It tributes as the cost, I know that, but I didn't know if it resolved in grave or not. Guess it doesn't, oh well. Yeah. <laughs> no, can't stop it that easily. <laughs> nope. So you went ahead and grabbed his house? I mean, I guess it's now stuck face up, so that's good if Pops does a magical plan, so that's good at least. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But at what cost <laughs> the play still goes off? Maybe maybe Pops did that on purpose. <laughs> maybe. Maybe he has that magical planter and he's like, oh well, I'm gonna play it. So is there anything else that he's going to do? Or is that it? Of course, he should probably go ahead and set some cards unless he's planning on pitching something to Rarid or Yen Face. Yep, there we go. At least one set. Even if it's a bluff. Better than just mm -hmm. negging for no reason. <laughs> Well, I guess the reason would be because you have too many cards in hand. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright, so. It's again Pop's turn. Let's go ahead and see what he does. Yep, and there it goes. <laughs> wow, you called it. <laughs> Went ahead and planted yeah. it up. I was like, there's no way Pops just did that for no reason. He's got to have done that for something. <laughs> Planter. Planters. Yep. Like the nuts. Planters so good. Planters is a card that I feel like wasn't that good when it probably first came out. But as more continuous shit keeps coming out, it's just going to get better and better and better and better. Yeah. Call the hunter, the wasted fiend is I'm surprised Telenites haven't started using it. I mean, I know they like to bounce shit with Triv, yeah, I think but... that since it's just said I'd rather go ahead and return to the hand with Triv. Yeah, I guess. Still. Yep, I'm gonna hold. So sometimes those extra draws can help. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, hold, no cost. Okay. Actually... Okay. Okay, okay. So go ahead. So he's gonna go ahead and use that up. It's interesting that he went ahead and pitched Scattershot because there's nothing for Scattershot to do, so... Well, he's, I mean... I don't know where he's going, so... <laughs> yeah? Damn. Take that slate. You get yeah. burned. <laughs> you get burned. How you like it? <laughs> How's it feel? Are you gonna? All right, so went ahead and burned for five hundred, which is fine. All right. So I'm guessing Slate must have some sort of response. I, I definitely think that, yeah, he definitely has a response to it, but I decided right, to do it. Alright, yeah, for uh, it, because otherwise you won't be getting that anal about announcing the activations and stuff like that. You won't really give a shit if you didn't have a response, so he clearly has something. It's interesting that, you know, Pops is kind of in a bind here, because he really can't do anything with any monsters, because as soon as he oh, does it, then... Oh, house another coming. turn of setting another bat rope. Yeah, yeah. Is it just set the Come bat on, guys, <laughs> y'all making this real, real <laughs> unentertaining. Let's go. Let's back door. This pops can't really summon any monsters because it seems he summons a monster, and then of course House Dunstan will come after it, and then 
mm-hmm. the trouble will ensue, so... Yeah, so... I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what Pops is gonna do. <laughs> I mean, they, they can burn, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> the, that Damn. sentence came out weird. <laughs> yeah, that did. That that sounded really wrong, Pop. <laughs> yes. The end shuffle and making us hard. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, buddy, you calm it down over there, okay? <laughs> Damn. No, another no, another weekend of the league is making the viewers hard, right, people? <laughs> <laughs> or someone come and be like, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and use okay. that reload. So one of your older viewers will probably come at like, Fuck you! Where's Daily Dolls? Where's Lime Y? Where is it? <laughs> oh, you know, uh, at least you guys are getting content all the time. You, know? you guys yeah, came no. for the league, but you stay for everything else. <laughs> so thank you guys for that. I really do appreciate yeah, actually, it. Actually, have you noticed viewership has been... Oh, fuck. Ooh, okay. <sighs> Go ahead and uh, wind it up. <laughs> yep. So... Both players, so what, both players take 300? Yep. What's up with this burn damage? <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny, they're not playing burn, but they're getting burn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, guess, I guess some of Slate's deck is burn. Uh, Ceasefires, the friggin, you know... Doesn't Slate just take dessert. 300 as well? Yeah, Slate takes 300, doesn't he? It's both players. Each player takes damage equal to the total number of cards destroyed. By its effect times 300. There we go. Oh yeah. 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 Wait, it's not focusing on burn, but it just happens to have some burn. <laughs> it just happens to have it for some re- well, of some reason. It's a good idea. Is the Dustins can just put a load of shit there and you just use it as a like sort of a uh a ghetto burn deck. <laughs> so he's not gonna chain. <laughs> He's just waiting. He's just waiting. Yeah. That's it's, it's just it's interesting. This is the way that uh, Pops is going at it because of course he summons a monster and the house comes after him. But then you know it's not like really Slate can dish out much damage. <laughs> otherwise. Mm-hmm. So maybe Slate, maybe Pops wants to go ahead and take it slow. Maybe get set up and prepare for uh, the plays. And then, well, of course, hope that's... Slate can set another card. Otherwise, yeah. Oh, well. yeah I was about to say yeah. otherwise he's just losing a card. Wow, ton of resources right now. <laughs> yep. Oh, oh damn. I'm just gonna go ahead and play Phoenix. Go ahead and put that back. Put something back, damn. Yep. Oh well. Mm. So now what? You're gonna pay that that 500 to go ahead and get another one? Yep. Well, kind of makes remind me of how Burning Abyss were when they first came out. Slow you and know. back rowy. Back, before they have fire back row-y and they not so back row-y, but they also use the uh the discard, you know, cards in traps, you know to their advantage. They still do that a bit. Just not they, as much. I, I think it's not like, just not as much. Maybe like one it's more Dante thing. and fire like your opponent to death. Like one Regeki break, one karma cut, like it's not as much as they used to do. No, not when they were only like triple Phoenix winged and triple karma cut and like damn. <laughs> it's like you know what, I didn't want to play anyway. <laughs> no, you know what? No, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> nope. So he's gonna go ahead and activate Blaze. Just Blaze. Blazed. Blazed. Four twenty Blazer. Let's go. The counter means that he hasn't used it for the turn. Yeah, I guess. What pops say? I believe that's it. I don't know. Well, let's let Pops clarify, because he, he'll be the one who knows. Yeah. Pops. Pops. Okay. Yeah, there we are. <laughs> That's fine. Alrighty. So he's going to go ahead and reload it up. Reload it. So is that fine? Yeah, activation's good. Right. Yes. I'd never, I never, I really didn't think that this duel was going to be like this. <laughs> I, oh, <it's> awesome. <laughs> yeah. Hey, can we get a little bit more aggressive here? <laughs> mm. You know what the good thing is? 
fuck. That, <laughs> these two don't won't duel each other until the finals. <laughs> Because they're yeah. actually in different divisions. That's so not even the play. It's actually the finals. <laughs> Holy crap. This is kind of slow. <laughs> A monster! It's like... These two do run them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no, oh, no, 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 oh, no, 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 never mind, monster. never mind. Hey, well, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Every time, like, finally, what, how many turns in? Like, feels like four million turns in, like, mm -hmm. <laughs> the monster. I, had to, I thought that had to be during the main phase. I guess it's his mm. next turn now. <laughs> Check out the omens. Yeah, I only gotta wait another 23 turns, yeah. like... Actually less than that now, but you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, he, well, he's just going through his deck. <laughs> oh, it's, it's like you when you first tried volcanics. Drawing, and drawing, <laughs> and drawing. Yeah. Just keep drawing. Slate. Not slight, um, not slight. Pops, you want to throw some Exodia up in there? Oh, yeah, obliterate. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, didn't, didn't you know about that pro strategy of, um... Didn't you know about that pro strategy in Volcanics? You just side Exodia in from your side deck. <laughs> what are you fighting for? <laughs> fighting for? Obliterate, that's what I'm fighting for. <laughs> oh, God. Hmm. So, oh my god, Pot summons a monster. <laughs> um, <laughs> of course, it goes to defense mode, so. <laughs> Alright. A monster? Okay, Sorry, what are, these th what are these things again? I, I forgot oh, I them. I pitch the Book of Moon. I mean, like, Book of Moon would be really useful when it comes to, you know, House Dustin coming after you. Yeah, but okay. You go ahead and summon that uh, volcanic rocket. It's blasting off again. <laughs> yes. You can't attack with volcanic rocket. No. Don't run Michael Cut. Get him! Get him! He's mine! He's fucking dead! Oh, never mind. <laughs> Ozzy's just like, yes! Finally! Smash his face in! Do it! Do it now! <laughs> It's like Monk. Oh. They see those two in two. Oh, I guess like Deku Starmo? Uh, makes sense. Just put some of your shit back. Okay. Oh, uh, of course! <laughs> you said Slate! You might as well be putting Exodia in the deck he's drawing that much. You didn't know that, you didn't know that he actually sides Exodia. <laughs> Yeah, you, you haven't seen his side deck. We've seen the five pieces. Hey, I've, I've seen the five pieces. The power. <laughs> and then and then when Pops drops Exodia, he's going to be like, These nuts. Gah, got him. <laughs> I don't know. He's uh, asking for the piece know. of Exodia. Don't worry about it. You'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> When he oh. obliterates did you. About you. The new, did you hear about the new uh, Exodia promo? Uh, Exodia's left testicle? Oh, it's so good. <laughs> you just drop, just drop me nuts on the mouth. <laughs> the Piper again. Uh, okay. the, now, when you, now when you draw into Exodia, you can really have these nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, he's just using the hell out of that Piper. Mm-hmm. Piper is good. Yeah. Especially in this deck. Yeah. Oh my god, Everybody in this deck, it's like it. a fucking beautiful card. Because mm -hmm. everything is level 1. Everything. It's kind of turning Piper into like a, like a pot of greed. Essentially, yeah, is. Yeah, use one drop and get two, yeah. So, can the Emerald go up again? I'm not sure how many monsters are still in the graveyard. Uh, I think he can. He probably will have enough one. Actually, that's an interesting point. For Emerald, say if Pops only has two, is he still able to detach? And then you get... Because he'd then have three on the detach. Or not. Because he wouldn't have the three monsters to detach to then shuffle the three. That's an interesting point. No, nope, there it answers your question. <laughs> oh. Oh, there we go. Then. You need three for activation. <laughs> yeah. 
but if he already has three, yeah, that's what I meant. If he already has three, he can, obviously, but, yeah. Right. But I meant if he had two, so, yeah, alright. I'm learning! <laughs> You're learning? Like, <laughs> like Ralph, I'm like Ralph Wiggum off The Simpsons when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh! I learning! Me fell English? That's improbable! <laughs> uh, I guess I can... Hopefully I can take off this fake beard that I'm growing. This <laughs> is still taking forever. Like this is this is round two, huh? <laughs> you have you grown much more of your hair back or you're still look, looking like a chocolate egg? You're dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> Does anybody else want to be the co commentator? <laughs> Cadbury's Dumbo. That's it. Oh damn. <laughs> All right, so he's gonna go ahead and uh, provoke yeah, that uh, well, side. Yeah, well, Daniel, at least I don't get fucking abducted and raped by Willy Wonka because I'm made of chocolate. So shut up. What kind? Of, what movie were you watching? <laughs> I don't know. I think... The best version mm -hmm. of the fucking <laughs> chocolate factory of Tony. All right. No, I watched. Uh, I watched the porno version, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Oh, Hello. So good. You... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, yeah. he's gonna go ahead and use that blaze accelerator. You don't want to know what he did with them on Palumpus in the movie. <laughs> That's it. No more drinking for me before these. No more! Alright, so... He's gonna go ahead and, uh, send... I don't know. <laughs> like, did he return, uh, the one scatter shot? Or was that last duel? I can't remember. No! Uh, counter! Mm -hmm. Oh, counter. I thought they only run one counter. I don't know. I guess he, I, guess he, I know he runs do, but I mean, typically volcanics. So I thought they only run one. Hmm. Yeah, counter yep. being engraved is really good, but typically they only run one, don't they? I've never seen him with more than one. It is a really good card. Yeah, a yeah. really good card right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. The thing is that he just has to, he has to survive. Yeah, it's not gonna cause a draw. Okay. So what's the idea now? Are you just gonna go into another soccer? Growing a beard here. <laughs> like, wow, this is actually how we're gonna go ahead and begin week two, huh? <laughs> yep. How long has this still been going? Half an hour. Oh my god. Well, wow, um... <laughs> Nothing's happening. <laughs> That's... Can I go ahead and go in a battle phase and crash? So true. Oh. Ow. Wow. Ow. It hurts. Oh. oh. Yeah, it hurts. oh. <laughs> Spread your butt, Slight. Spread your butt. <laughs> Ooh. Another fairy wind. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. And again, Slate has drawn enough cards to probably draw another fairy. This whole duel, like they should have everything. This, the, we you should sure? be, we should be looking at a freaking chain link seven right now. <laughs> chain link, a chain link fifty nine. Let's go. How that was possible, I don't know, but let's go. So, why is the record for long biggest chain link in Yu Gi Oh? There's got to be somewhere where there's a record of it. I have. No I, bet idea. Some, I bet it's something ridiculous, like chain link thirty seven or some shit. That is true. Yeah, if he's gonna lose the door, he can't use counter. Yeah, you... He's already lost by the time it would activate. Yep. <laughs> so he's gonna go ahead and uh, smash that uh, house. Do some uh, redecorating of the house there. <laughs> Let's go ahead and summon all the nestings. <laughs> and now, now, uh, what was it? Double. Um... Double just desserts for game. Well, not game, but, you know. That for a nice chunk. Maybe a little bit of ceasefire, maybe a little bit of secret barrel. <laughs> Say what? Why don't you throw some friggin' Uzakis in there? <laughs> <laughs> meteor. Destruction Meteor, or whatever that card's called that does a thousand. So many. <laughs> Holy shit. What is the power level of so, that album? King? So much dust. Someone needs to sprinkle it. <laughs> yes. 
What's the power level of the Dustins? They're zero! Wait, what? What's the power level of the Goblin King? I don't know. Over 9,000? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Magical cylinder. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Flip it down! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Do it. Okay. Oh damn. And? Oh damn. Alright. Attack decoration. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. I said, I don't know what he has in the graveyard, go. so. Third fairy win. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, where's MST? I haven't seen MST all though. No, I think we did. We see an MST or an install? Yeah, I, think I, I think that's like, where's, where's Slate's MST? I'm sure. <laughs> I can't <if> find it. <laughs> yeah. Eighteen cards. Yeah. That's, that's that's always the way, though, isn't it? You know what I mean? Every time you're like, I really want to get rid of that fucking continuous card. Where are my MSTs? Okay. Oh damn. Does he already have a shot in the grave or does he? I have no idea. I think there's something that I think, I think, I think, I think, he, I think he has the same two, and I'm not sure if he has another one in grave. Yeah. There's, I know Shot oh, needs yeah. to. In which case, he, yeah. he messed up. <laughs> yeah, Shot needs to send the other two to get the destruction of that, so yeah, that's why I asked. But. I know I saw a shot go there earlier, but I wasn't sure if you shuffled it back with Emerald. Yeah, but say, you can't do that. You attacked, yeah. you activated a card. So, yeah, if you reload resolve, yeah. how do you activate a breakthrough skill? Yeah, when it's already resolved. Yeah. 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 Damn. Yeah, that's it. The Dustins. Yeah, the dust. Damn, reject. Damn, <laughs> damn. <laughs> Again? Say <laughs> <laughs> double just desserts. Oh my god, so many oh just desserts. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, he'll have trouble. He'll have double just desserts. That has actually has the tr double just desserts. Oh my desserts. god! So if if Password even activated an uh, <laughs> uh, even uh, activated another uh, shell, <laughs> as we yeah. down to forty nine just desserts, just desserts game. <laughs> like, oh my god! Ooh. Well, there we go, people. So there is your uh, season one, week two, match one duel. We have. Blake gets two points. He is in second place so far. Yep, as of now. Yep, as of now. Yep. So, all right. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Uh, look forward to more this uh, this week, week two. So, of course, you'll get a video at two, and then you'll get two more videos tomorrow for uh, week two. So, uh, thank my co-host Stanzi for joining me. No problem. Thank all the participants. Uh, everybody's link is, of course, in the description. So go ahead and to their channel and check them out. Uh, thank you guys for taking the time to watch and support me. And, uh, yeah, we will see you guys and uh, the rest of the week. So see you guys in, yeah. uh, like, in like, a couple hours, like two hours, with uh, Season 1, Week 2, Match 2. That's good. I'm, <laughs> I'm just gonna, it's going to take me a while to get used to that. It's going to get awkward, isn't it? <laughs> All right. We're never going to get it. All right, people. Thanks for watching.